as you already know, this is the video update for my TS Clay matte black carbon fiber lip spoiler installation video. Well, this is the tape that I used, the 3M clear packing tape, the stronger glue bonding and the 3M blue masking tape. The really strong one, I put them in the corner right here and this corner right here, okay? And the rest of them, I used the smack skin tape. Originally, I was gonna leave it for 72 hours with all this tape, but I start thinking, maybe that's not a good idea because it might leave the, because see, this is such a strong tape, as you already know, the longer you stick a tape, it will eventually leave a glue marking, right? So what I did was that exactly on the 24 hour um, time, I took it off, all of them, okay? I inspected, there was no gapping. And here's another thing, I left it in the garage for another two and a half days. So I didn't drove this car literally for three and a half days, all right? For this reason, I seen video on YouTube all the time, oh, put it on, leave it on for 24 hours, the tape, and you can bounce, you can do whatever you want. Some of them seven, eight hours, some of them like 10 hours, some of them 14 hours, but I read the 3M website, some of the double-sided tape, it takes up to 72 hours for it to fully cure. As you already know, the tape, the 3M tape that comes with the spoiler is in Chinese. I don't read Chinese. I don't know exactly what it say on the on the you know the plastic um, labeling. So what I did is was lift this fully cure for 80 hours, 84 hours ish. Okay, that's my total hours of this sitting in the garage. For this reason, those of you like, why J spec? Why you live this so long? Because when you take out the tape, right? If the tape that I have it takes 72 hours to cure. All of this side it will still cure. As you already know, the aerodynamic of our car, right? The air goes this way. In Vegas, no matter how clean your car is, look at it. I just took it out, literally. I just took it out like for a quick drive to um, store. So that's what I mean, like, right? When you install this thing, take your time. Hopefully you have a second car. I was blessed enough to have a second and third car to use rather than the tesla so i left this in the garage for this reason i don't want no vibration like you know when you drive the car the vibration because like you know like you know those of you that's on a model y model 3 you own tesla this car is pretty fast on the gas so i don't want no vibration to jeopardize the the glue for sticking it correctly and on top of it i don't want the wind to blow this way right when you go fast the wind goes really really goes in there and on top of it, I don't want all this particle, this little dust particle to go in between our spoiler. I think that's what's most gapping issue is, is from most of the guys that installed the spoiler or the lady, they drove the car too quickly. They were excited. Like, don't get me wrong. I was eager, itchy to drive my car because it looked way nicer now with this lip spoiler, but I had to be patient on this one because I don't want no gapping. So I let it cure fully in reality, like about 80 hours. So now, as you can see, I'm gonna show you, right? There is, here, I'm gonna zoom in. There is no gapping whatsoever, right? Because the reason why I don't think there's no gapping because I really, really let the 3M tape cure right i'm gonna try to go as slow as possible here that's some of you that install this have gapping on the bottom and so on but i don't have no problem with the gapping issue because i took the time for it to cure fully and on top of it i took the time the carbon fiber spoiler came without the 3m tape already on it I took the time to install the 3M tape on the spoiler itself, let that cure, then 
I took the time to install it and I actually pull it from each side instead of lifting it up all the way. So I put it on each side a little bit and then as I put it on, I pull it all the way. And you know, here's the result. You gotta be patient. I understand like, you know, when you do a mod on your car, you wanna drove it right away. You wanna show it right away because it feels good, right? You pay for it, you wanna do it. But sometimes it, some mod, you really, really need to wait for it to cure correctly to prevent you more money to spend on buying another spoiler another 3m tape and so on and so on right well that is my video update don't forget to click the thumbs like that appreciate i know that helped my video a lot so my video doesn't get lost people will watch this video share my video all right peace out take care stay tuned for mod number 21 peace out take care Stay tuned for more video. Peace. <laughs>